Philippines in partnership with the Department of Tourism through the Tourism Promotions Board has been actively promoting local tourism under the Visit the Philippines Drive to Discover with Nissan program. Today, I am taking you along to discover fabulous Zambales and it's all aboard this cleverly convenient Nissan Almera. Our first destination was a non-commercialized area of Virgin Islands with no hotels, just cabanas, beach, and sand. So we're off to Anawangin Island. I'm very excited. I've never been there and so I prepared by wearing this hat to protect from the sun. The impressively spacious Nissan Almera was an appropriate ride for this journey to explore Zambales. This B-segment car is a classic four-door, five-seat vehicle with a notably fuel-thrifty 1.5-liter engine whose main selling point is its whopping 2,600-millimeter wheelbase, among the most generous in its class. The ride is comfortable and I think that's one of the basic characteristics that you need for a car that you take on long drives. Our convoy drove through the less traveled roads of Zambales with beautiful mountainous views and a greater countryside vibe. And so we're going aboard the Banca! We then landed the seaside area of Pundakit where we boarded Katik boats and took off to the sea towards the hidden gem that is Anawangin Cove. First impressions of the island. Well, I think what's kind of fascinating is the fact that I don't see any permanent structures. There are all these kubos where you guys can stay the night, camping style. It's also a cove that's really surrounded by mountains. So if you want to go hiking, I think that's very possible. Just a little bit offshore is this large forest area that people have turned into campground. And as you can see, medyo umaambon ngayon but hindi porket nasa beach tayo ay ibig sabihin laging mainit dahil ang buhay ay weather, weather lang. The following day, we also got to experience the adrenaline rush of the Treetop Adventure Park in Subic. and then proceeded to Castillejo Zambales to visit the ancestral home of former President Ramon Magsaysay. We even squeezed in a short stop at Rosa Farms, a 12.5-hectare mango orchard in San Marcelino, famous for producing some of the sweetest mangoes in the region. Of course, the spacious Nissan Almera easily accommodated all our pasalubongs. Indeed, there still remain a lot of hidden gems waiting to be discovered in the Philippines. So as long as you have a nice and reliable car to take you around, it will always be more fun in the Philippines. Alright guys, there you have it. We just cleaned the beautiful car right there. It looks pretty clean. It has a little more to do because I'm not yet that expert in cleaning the vehicle. But. You know, it's very, very fun. I've, I've learned so much from Mr. Two right here and with Sonax. Thank you very much for having us, for being with us, to teaching us what the proper techniques and what the proper tools and, and soaps we need to clean our, our vehicle. So, maraming maraming salamat po. 